AWS Elemental Media Connect recently announced their support for SRT Ingest. This makes it capable of receiving streams from all modern Incorizon media servers. Nimble Streamer Media Server is capable of processing multiple live streaming protocols. This allows making various transformations. This video will show how to transform an NDI source into SRT with Nimble Streamer and deliver it to AWS Media Connect. You'll also find other related docs in this video description. We'll use a tool from NDI Toolset to generate pattern-based video. This will be our NDI source. Nimble Streamer has a separate tool which allows listing available NDI sources. We copy our source name for further usage. In this video we use a pre-installed instance of Nimble Streamer with live transcoder. Transcoder is required for NDI transformation and we have it installed. It also has an active registered license. We create a new transcoder scenario which will transform NDI input into proper output. Source stream will have an NDI source name that we've copied previously. The encoders will have app name and stream name that we'll use later for SRT delivery. Here we use default encoder settings for demo purposes. As you can see, we use WMSPL Cloud Control Panel for centralized control over Nimble Streamer instances. Once the scenario is saved and synchronized, it will start processing the incoming NDI stream. Let's check the result via HLS stream output to make sure the processing is working. You can see it playing, which means we can proceed with further setup. Let's go to the Media Connect console and create a new flow there. The protocol field must be set to SRT listener. Then we define an inbound port where Nimble will connect to. You also must define a CIDR to whitelist your IP address for security purposes. The latency parameter may be defined here as well if you cannot define it on the sender side. Once we save the flow, we can see the outbound IP address, which we can now use for publishing into Media Connect. Now let's return to Nimble Streamer settings and create an ongoing SRT connection. SRT push mode needs to be used, also known as caller. The remote address is the outbound IP, which was assigned previously by AWS in the flow settings. Remote port is the same as the inbound port from the flow settings. Source application and stream name were previously defined in our NDI transcoding scenario. When you save settings, they are synchronized with NimbleStreamer within seconds. Once they are applied, the SRT streaming to Media Connect will be started. Now let's get back to our flow settings and start it. As soon as the status changes to active, uh, you'll see data charts. That means that our stream gets in successfully. You can now proceed with further processing of your stream in Amazon Cloud. Please refer to Elemental Media Connect documentation for more details. The described use case gives flexibility for various live production teams which use NDI as their primary format and who want to deliver the results to a wider audience over the Amazon network. 